done a great job of allowing me to come back and do that. What stands out to you about Oklahoma's offense? Uh, you know, they're athletic. Uh, some guys up front that can move, you know. Some of the guys aren't very big, but they can move around. Quarterback's good, can make plays. Uh, you know, they've got a good, great group of receivers. Uh, Shepard kid is super good. So, I mean, they're just a good offense. You know, big running back who can run the ball. They got two guys, 25, can fly. So, I mean, it's just, they're just a good overall team on offense, especially. Where are they, where are they, where are they much better on uh, the field? I just think they just, you know, they, they're comfortable with their system a lot more this year. Uh, you know, new coordinator in, a new quarterback. You know, I think they just got confidence in that guy. He can make plays. And, they're just excited about him being back there. You know, I think the team thrives off that, you know. How we thrive off of Deshaun being back there and, you know, having a good quarterback, just a good quarterback period. So the team just feeds off that energy they get. Their offensive front, protection-wise, uh, athletically, who do they look like that you face this year? Uh, can't really point to a team now. Um, you know, I know, a lot of the other guys might be able to point to a better team, but uh, I think they got some really good interior guys. Outside guys are young, but they're pretty good too. So I mean, I just, I just think they're just a good overall front. You got some experience against Piran. I see Mixon for the uh -huh. first time. Who do those guys remind you of? Uh, Piran's kind of like a bigger Elijah Hood. He runs the ball hard. You know, good runner. He can forget, has breakaway speed, but can make him run between the tackles. Mixon kind of gives you a mind of. Uh, Kind of like that guy from Notre Dame, you know, big, tall, little taller guy who can just who can move and flat out fly straight ahead, especially. So I think those two guys, are just, they're, they're really good guys. You guys seem to play better recently against teams that do run downhill a little bit more than <coughs> so advance in the backfield. Do you feel more confident against guys that run? Oh, uh, you know, I think we feel confident. We feel like we're gonna have a good plan, and you know, playing against that team last year, it just really it makes us feel confident, not just because of the guys out there, but because we've seen them and we played against them before, so you know we can go watch all the games, the game from last year, and all the games they've had this year, so we can just have a great plan on it. How do you balance the confidence that comes from last year to knowing that it is a little bit better team, especially in the quarterback position? Oh, uh, I think you just know that any given Saturday you can lose. So I mean, just just knowing that you can't go in overconfident, and cocky. You know, you just gotta go in there and play the game. Football's a game you gotta earn every down, every play. So. You know, we know that, we understand that, and we're, we're ready to get, get that opportunity to go out there and earn it. What would be your career? What do you think you made the biggest jump in the program? Uh, just last from last year, was it, was it, what, do you, what did you, what, can you point to one year when you said, I really improved that? Oh, you know, just this year, I've gotten a, a lot, maybe not on the field, but I've gotten a lot more mentally strong. You know, my mentality is a lot different now. And, you know, I've been through a lot these last two years, so I'm just, I'm more mentally strong, and that's going to carry me a lot. Way a long way is not only in football but in life. So, you know, I think though this this year improving mentally and being more mentally in shape. You know, I've been in physical shape the last two years, three years. We play really good football, but you know, just being mentally prepared to go out and understand what I have to do to be a football player and understand what I got to do in the classroom and how to be a good citizen has really helped me a lot this year.